Throwing around any glass is dangerous. I know, I have the scars to prove it. And this is six dangerous glassware moves that I'm gonna show you today, some of which I used whilst making these June bugs, which are on my cocktail channel. But enough about that, let's make it happen. This is one of the easier glassware moves to learn. All you're doing with the glass is throwing it up and catching on top of it with your opposite hand. You're gonna throw the glass up, or the shaker, and move your other hand down. As the glass comes up, your other hand comes around over on top and grab. So you go down over grab. And if you wanna take it to another level, you can try and do a double spin with your hand. <sighs> Place the glass on the elbow where you're gonna catch it. And then you can learn to balance that glass on the elbow. Then you wanna to learn to drop the glass onto your elbow and just keep doing that a few times. Try and drop from different angles so that you can get used to when the glass is flying over in a different way. And do that a few times until you feel confident about catching it. And then finally, the throw, which in this case is the over the shoulder. Learn how to throw it over until you get the right spin and the right position to where you need to catch it. And then when you feel confident, you can take the other hand away whoop, and try and land the move. Use your other hand to manipulate the glass around your finger and around your thumb, mimicking how the move is gonna work. Then once you've learned that, you're gonna break the move down into two moves, the finger roll and the thumb roll. You're gonna rest the glass in your four fingers and you're gonna swing the glass up and around so it comes up and swings around your finger. Then you'll catch the glass near the base and you're gonna push the glass at the base with your thumb and let the glass drop down and around and then you bring your hand down under the glass to catch it. And then when you're confident, you're gonna do the whole thing together. Yes. First things first, you're gonna do the simple roll. So palms facing up, you're just gonna lift your arm up and let the glass roll down your arm. Then you're gonna to learn to throw the glass by spinning it. So you're gonna lift the glass up, spin it with your fingers, like this. And then once you've got that, you're gonna stick your hand underneath through the glass, through the glass. And you see your arm moves and the glass rolls up your arm and then you catch it in your hand. Now, once you get really good, then you can try and roll the glass and catch it behind your back using the ha same hand that you're rolling with. Yes. The first thing you're gonna learn is to throw and catch a glass behind your back. Now, I've done lots of behind the back videos. Up there, as usual. Uh, and then you need to learn how to do the little push. As you throw the glass up, you're gonna throw it at your other hand. Your other hand is gonna make the glass spin, and then that's gonna drop down behind your back. This time I'm actually gonna be straining with my left. So I put the strainer on ready for my left hand. Then I place the glass into position. Make sure I've got the balance. And then I can grab hold of the shaker ready for straining. Now the trick from here is to not fill it up all the way because you wanna be able to do the next part of the trick, which is up, down, onto the back of the hand. 
Use your knees to move the glass. Oh, yes. So there you have it, six glorious glassware moves. Take your time with those, practice with polycarbonates or with shakers beforehand if you can until you build up your confidence. Nice to see all the subscribers here and if you are new around here please consider subscribing and click that bell for notifications so you can learn more flare bartending videos like this one. Anyway thank you so much for watching I really do appreciate all of you being here and if you like this video smash that like button and check this one out next because now you've learned how to flare with the glassware, this one will teach you how to put the ice inside the glassware in a really stylish way. It's quite an old video, but I will make a new one soon. And the more you like this video, the more I'll move on to doing another one, which is all about stemmed and martini style glassware. Anyway, until next time, I'll see you then.